Hi, I'm uh, Paula Mangiacabra, and I'm a watercolor artist here represented by uh, the Spring Bowl Gallery, which is a cooperative, so I'm one of 17 artists who are fortunate enough to be uh, members of this gallery. And uh, at present, I'm working on two uh, small pieces that uh, are trying to get ready for our little picture show, which is coming up in uh, July this year. I'm just going to work a little bit on the piece, and I might say a few things as we go along, or I may not. So basically, this entire painting has been done with uh, transparent watercolors. The palette is pretty dirty looking, but by the time the pigments get onto the paper, if I've done my job, it should look fairly translucent and uh, pleasing to the eye. So the only things uh, left to do here might be to strengthen some of the values in the windows that are on the sides of this building. So I'm using a microscopic brush just to put small indications of window pane, perhaps. I try not to fill in every one, which forces the viewer to apply their brain. With a painting this small, to try to do any detail and paint around the whites, which is the ideal way to do it. Uh, I've done that here. I've done that in the crosswalk. I've done that on this indication of a van here in the trunk of this tree. But in some places, like the highlights on these windows and so forth, if I had had to paint around that, I wouldn't have got this beautiful glowing wash because you want to do that all in one go. So there's a, an acrylic medium called gesso that is, will accept watercolor pigment on top of it. So I'm going to just go in just with a, a small amount of that right in here, just to bring out some highlights. If I don't like it, I can just draw my finger across. And that livens up a dark area that might otherwise be totally uninteresting. So I think I'm at the stage now where I need to leave it alone because if I push it any further, I could end up with something that looks overworked, which I don't think this painting does at this point. So I'm just going to leave it alone. Well, I'm really pleased, I'm really pleased that I had this opportunity to uh, showcase my work and uh, thanks for joining us.